This nice lady came into the urgent care. She's in her late 40s and comes in because she scratched her right eyebrow and within the next day or so she had swelling around the eye and the cheek. She has a little bit of a fever. Uh, when looking at this, I need to determine if the infection is actually spread into the orbit itself or has uh, just pretty much stayed in front of the orbit in the surrounding tissues which is really most important. She kind of has an angioedema picture as well, which is a significant allergic reaction. So looking at this picture, we can see in the rectangles the orbital septum. And this is the anatomical point that defines either a periorbital cellulitis or preceptal cellulitis and an orbital cellulitis. When the inflammation is in front of the eye or before the septum, we call it a periorbital cellulitis or a preceptal cellulitis. When the infection has spread beyond the septum and into the orbit, we call it obviously orbital cellulitis. Now you can imagine if the infection spreads so much and causes an abscess, it can actually cause vision loss by compression of the optic nerve, and also it can cause an exophthalmos, as you'll see in this next picture. What we see here is obviously a depiction of a woman with an orbital cellulitis in the right eye and you can see it pushing the eye out. So after treatment of some steroids and some antibiotics, she did very well. We treated her with amoxicillin as well as Bactrim to cover uh, MRSA. And I also gave her some steroids which will help with the surrounding inflammation as well as treat an underlying angioedema if it's there. This is less likely but I felt it was important to use it anyway. I'm anticipating a full recovery.